want to transfer your Microsoft Authenticator app to a new phone without losing access to any of your account, in this video I will show you how to do it step by step depending upon your backup settings. On your current phone, open up Microsoft Authenticator and go to the menu. Now here we want to go to setting, we want to make sure that our backup is turned on and a recovery account is added. This backups allows you to move everything securely to the new device. So here the recovery account is added and additionally the cloud backup is turned on. As this is a demo video on transferring Microsoft Authenticator app from one phone to another, I have added only one account. Microsoft Authenticator is downloaded. Let's tap on open. And here we have to accept the agreements. That's fine. Let's continue. And now we got sign in with Microsoft, add work or school account or scan QR code. And the last one is restore from a backup. There are two ways to restore from a backup. So let's proceed here. Restore from a backup. Now at this page, we want to tap on begin recovery. Once I have clicked on begin recovery, I have to enter that Microsoft account that was added at the backup of old phone okay next and let's say i don't have access to old phone i want to use my password instead now at this step i ensured you that we could also go ahead and recover account without having old phone and here i got different option to get the verification code Approve request from Microsoft app, use a verification code from a mobile app, and the next is email. So let's say I have access to only email. We have to enter the recovery email to get the code. Okay, let's send the code. And the code is 685842. Let's verify. And here you go now you can see my accounts are successfully recovered and automatically added to microsoft authenticator app without having access to my old phone perfect so either on your iphone or your android phone always make sure in the settings menu you have turned on the cloud backup and you have added the recovery account because this recovery account will always recover your all of the account that were added to Microsoft Authenticator. So that's it about today's quick video. If this helped you out, give the video a like and subscribe for more easy tutorials. Drop your questions in the comment as well. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one.